everybody. Uh. <laughs> hey everybody, this is Libby Project. I am Brooks. <laughs> I'm Joanna. This is our level two class in week two. Thanks for coming out. We'll show you guys what we did. We did some more six and eight count stuff. First, did our, our compare and contrast with the side pass and the swing out. Side pass being this one. A one, two, three, five, and six. One, two, triple step, triple step, 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 triple, triple. Swing out, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, and step, step, triple, step, step, triple. The idea being that followers, we should think, at least in this, in this exercise, about always doing that six count side pass and therefore allowing the lead to create a catch that will redirect us and change our footwork and turn it into a swing out. And then we wanted to give you guys some moves that were six count based to go from close to open. We did yeah. three of them. First, we did our send down. We'll do a basic first. Send down to pull more cards from this angle. Basic. Then we gave it one turn, and we call that a tuck turn. Basic first. Boop, 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 boop. From this angle. A triple, a triple. A rock. Clear the hair. <laughs> then we made it two turns and eight counts, and we call that a double tuck turn. And eight counts double. Basic first. A hoop, hop, hoop, hop. Notice that the leader will follow the follower during the step step part or the five step. And one more time, we're going to do it at the camera to kind of demonstrate that it's a down the line. Yeah? Hop, hoop, hoop. And then lastly, we talked about, you know, after the rocks, I'm just that switching the hand. Stealthy. But well, thanks for coming out to you guys. We'll see you for week three.